What is color gamut? Most people see different colors by seeing differences in light. Let's look at an apple. We see it because light reflects back to our eyes. Our eyes talk to our brain, which interprets the apple as red. Colors become real when processed by the brain. Three primary colors. Eyes have L, M, and S cone cells, sensitive to different light wavelengths. Our cone cells react to three primary colors, red, green, and blue. That's known as trichromatic vision. All other colors are combinations of the primary three. That's why every monitor and display is based on RGB. Colors seen by our eyes also have luminance and chrominance values, which we can calculate, usually in a horseshoe-shaped figure. This is the CIE UV color space, which covers all colors seen by the average human eye. Display colors originate in RGB. If at their brightest, that means the display can show every color in the CIE UV color space. Color space means color gamut. These vary by display, but good screens have wide color gamuts for rich, accurate colors. Many gamuts exist, like sRGB, Adobe RGB, NTSC, and DCI-P3, designed for different applications. Applications of the RGB color model. sRGB is the most common, used on cameras, monitors, TVs, web pages, and more. Consistency across devices is its main advantage. Adobe RGB is wider than sRGB by about 20% and used mostly in photography and printing with good cross-media capabilities. NTSC was created by the National Television Standards Committee. It shares green values with Adobe RGB, but not red and blue. DCI P3 was defined by Digital Cinema Initiatives, designed for digital movie projection. It's used in theatrical and home cinema projectors. BenQ knows accurate color is essential and developed AQ color technology to ensure the finest monitor color precision in every application in order to create colors you can trust.